hi everyone and welcome back to my channel and I'm back yay finally <laughs> now to start things off I will showing you a little boss fight here um, I was farming him the sergeant it's called for the gallium as you can see he just dropped one there and uh, for some blueprints and we will get to that later first of all let's discuss what happened and why um, I didn't upload so first things first I still didn't fix my issues with the editing software. Now I have edit edited these things in another software, which I absolutely don't like. I don't know, but uh, <laughs> I will stick to it until I fix the other issue. And yeah, so that's pretty much it for the recording software. Now here is another little gameplay clip. Um, of a little defense which I just did for fun basically <laughs> and uh, you have to defend this cryopod and yeah sorry for that strange aiming right there uh, it is a good place to level up your basic guns as well so I think that's about it yeah, I'm pretty sure I was just clearing up some notes, some new missions, so I can actually complete Earth, the first planet. That's basically what I was doing here. Now, the other issue with the headset, I do have an update on that, and it's bad news. So, yeah, my Triton Pro Plus definitely is broken. Um, I did ask the guys at the support, Triton support, and they were telling me, yeah, man, you know, we could fix it, but it will probably cost you more than buying a new one. <laughs> so yeah, I will just stick to my AX180s for now, uh, which I actually do use on the PC. But um, I did found a way to connect them to the PS4, so I should be able to do some live commentaries as well. But here is another thing, I will stick to one upload a week and Warframe only at the moment. Now why? It is pretty easy. <laughs> I, at the moment, I can't really play Black Ops 3. Now, as weird as that sounds, but um, I have so much lag issues, it's not, it's just not playable for me, and uh, I still enjoy the game, that's not the problem, you know, but when I get lag like that, um, I, I can't do it, I'm sorry, I just can't, really, that's... <sighs> yeah. <laughs> So that's why I will stick to Warframe on um, Minecraft. I will try to um, record a ton of gameplay and then just cut them, cut everything together and do a voiceover or a post commentary like I do it with Warframe um, to test once more if that is actually a good idea or not. For me personally, I would enjoy the live commentary more in Minecraft. But on the other hand, if I have to explain or do like to explain my redstone, uh, it's so much easier post commentary <laughs> because you don't have to think what you're doing at the moment. You can just basically follow your memories and uh, post comment everything. So yeah, that's why I will stick to Warframe in the first plane place. Uh, the other reason is I am playing with a nice guy from Canada a lot at the moment, and uh, I will ask him to. Uh, if he would be interested to include his voice also in these commentaries, just little gameplay sections where you can uh, listen to our conversations. We are having some really funny chitty chats <laughs> while we're farming stuff and uh, yeah, that's another thing as well. So as you can hear, I do have a lot of stuff in my mind at the moment and uh, yeah, I have to... Oh, I remember now, I'm sorry, I wasn't maxing out my gun or unlocking a new node here. I was actually looking for a new resource, which is plastids, which you will need to craft middle game to late game stuff. Uh, all the good weapons, or most of the good weapons, uh, require plastid. So I was really hoping to get one, and um, I think I did. And I think it was the node unlocking as well. So I think I mixed those two together. Uh, hoping for some plastics while clearing out some of the newer missions uh, on the new planet. That is pretty much it. I think I'm on Jupiter right here. I'm not too sure. I will have to check that. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Now you have to complete five waves to actually be able to extract and fulfill the mission. 
you can stay longer, which will mean better rewards. And it is an AABC loot table as well, like survival. Uh, if you stay for 5 waves, waves, you get loot from table A. The same at 10 waves, 15, you will get a B, which is um, better drops, I guess. Yeah, you can call them better, or higher ranked. And uh, at 20 waves, you will get a drop from the C loot table, which is the best. Uh, you can get rare stuff there. And yeah, so when you're in such missions where you're doing this, stay until 20 waves if you can do it. If not, leave at 15, that is fine as well. You will get some good stuff out of, of the B drop table. Um, but here I think I just stayed until wave 5, because I was just after Plastid and not locking the mode to get a better mission to farm Plastid, and uh, that's why I will leave after this wave. It is the last wave, so I'm using my Exalted Plate, which is the ultimate ability of my Warframe Excalibur. And that is strong, you see there, I one-shot every enemy with that. And uh, yeah, now let's see, yeah, I do extract, perfect. <laughs> that was what well, uh, I was thinking that, that I would do that, so that is pretty good. And uh, coming up now, I was after another resource, which is Salvage. And um, yeah, so I just played through some missions. Uh, this one was a exterminate where you just have to kill every single enemy, which is uh, most of the time pretty easy and straightforward to complete. Sometimes you ha do have to backtrack, but uh, I don't care too much about that. And uh, yeah, as you see, I'm not using now the Bratton, no, uh, no more the Mark One Bratton because I did max this uh, the Mark One Bratton out, reached level 30, and then basically sold it. And bought, my, bought me the Bratton. Now, I did... No, I didn't. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> um, I'm playing another defense mission here to actually farm the salvage as I was... Yeah, as I said, it, I was after salvage here. And um, yeah, I just ranking up like crazy to reach higher mastery ranks because some weapons you can only unlock if your mastery rank is high enough. So yeah, that is why I keep switching guns after I max them out. And uh, yeah, let's be honest, the starting weapons are not that good at all for... I think even mid-game, their the damage drop-off is just too huge. And there you saw I just got some salvage and I was freaking happy with that. <laughs> so yeah, I just continue played this defense mission to the end. And um, as you can see, again, it is the last wave, so basically I'm just using up energy. I'm just going for the Exalted Blade. I love this thing so much. Um, I will get me a very, very powerful sword to get the full potential out of this ability. And then you will basically see critical hits over 10,000 and stuff like that. Did I say 10,000? I meant over 9,000, of course! <laughs> nah, but it's, I think it is in 15,000 or something like that with the non-leveled weapon. And uh, when I maxed this thing out, um, yeah, that's when the real stuff will happen. That's where the real damage drops in, but it will take me some time to get there. And as you see, I extracted here as well because I was just after the salvage and uh, coming up now is my search for neural sensors because I need them to craft a weapon and uh, yeah. So I went ahead and played the survival mission which is one of my favorite game modes definitely. So basically you do have life support, you start with 100%, the enemy will stop the oxygen generators and stuff and basically if you reach life support 0% you will die so that is what you don't want obviously and uh, yeah I just extracted here and uh, yeah so you have these towers that you can activate which give you 15% uh, 30% and you can find some stuff to give you 5% which will be dropped from enemies so that's all for today thank you very much